Now then, the old job. Now just have a quick catch up. I just got some eat fish. I'm giving some dog biscuits. Been pissing down as you can see all day. So it's summer again. Getting some dog biscuits. No quick catch up anywhere. Monkeys are all in bed now. <coughs> Tell you what I've been doing. You know them cages that I build? And uh, stops your monkeys getting stressed out. I basically put this video on because I'm waiting for my friend to ring up from London. There's the cages, look. You cut an hole in the side of your cage, fit these on, and I use like a bungee strap to hold it in the slider. And you can like you can catch your monkeys and they're done. Bit of lugs on the top. Um I'll put that one down there. So we have a bungee strap holding it on so the monkeys can't slide the door. But I've just built this one. This one here. Let's have a look. I haven't put the hooks on it yet because I'm waiting for my friends to give the measurements. There's a the new one. This one is the new improved model because I've put a hook on there, look. Then open it, slide it out, slide it back in. Once you've got it in, put the hook down, monkey can't get out. So that's a new improved model. <laughs> so that's for Jamie in London. He's picking his new mamas up next week and he wants to bring them in the house on the night and then put them out during the day. But like I say, they're brilliant, brilliant cages. And then, if, like, I had a monkey, what, um, he'd been bit on his tail. And uh, what you do, you turn the cage upside down, like that, long ways. And then, what you do then, um, you can hook it on like that, look, the opposite way to what it goes, let it hang. And at the bottom there, you can pull his tail through this groove I've cut in it. Pull his tail through there and treat his tail while he's stood in that cage. Like that. So, he'd been bit, he was arguing with his missus. So, I don't know. So that's the cages. There's mine. There's Jamie's. The new improved model. Mark 2. Go see the marmosettes. I haven't been on for a while. So, one of the females and he's pregnant. See all this. Don't think nobody's up. See the old girl comes out. Come on. Come on then. Come on, have a jelly. Come on, come on, have your jellies. Come on then, don't be ignorant. Open your door. Come on then. Come on, baby. She's 14, she likes to shut the door and I ain't got to bed. Come on, then. Come on. No. Yeah. It's been raining all day, she's gone in and uh, got um, tucked up in bed. Come on, then. Come on, baby. Come on, then. You ain't giving up for nobody. Come on. Come on then. Um, my friends sent these down. And, uh, they're like them uh, Aribo teddies. And there's 200 international units in each one. 200. They're like little baby mice. Show you one. 200 international units of D3 in them, each one. So, see if they like them. There's a little troop coming out, look. Come on then. Come on then. Come on. Come on then. Let me get your jelly. Where's Taffy? Come on, son. Come on, son. Come and get your jelly. Good boy. Come on. See if they like these jellies. Come on then. Ooh, Dad's gone for it. Oh, look at that. Come on, son. Having a sniff of it, see what it's like. Oh, he's having a go now. There's mum. Come on then, here then. There you go, baby. Go black the faces. 
Oh, we could have Mama's X. Jet black like that, look. There you go, look. There you go, darling. She's pregnant. I've just had the old deer get up. Leave the door open. See if he wants one. Yeah, there are 200 international units each one. It's good like, innit? Come on, baby. Come on, then. Yeah, she's coming out long. She's lit the door open. Come on, baby. Come on, then. Don't you all open the door. No, get off the door while I open it. Get off the door, good girl. Good girl. Oh, you like them, don't you? Oh, rubbing it on my hand. Yeah, then. There you go, come on then, get it then. Here's one for her, look. You've got one. Good girl. You know I mean? There's no need to uh, stress them out. A lot of people have been uh, taking the mickey over the last year saying, ah, oh, you clean them out so much and this and that and the other. But like I say, he will last, last, last longest. A lot of, I've had a lot of reports of uh, meerkats, mamzets, other types of animals, all dying from Unisia. It's only down to bad husbandry, animal care. So, men are all alright. The winter pens, what they usually stay in. I've emptied that one, that's getting cleaned out. I've done this one, look. That one's all done, look. All ready for winter. Everything power washed, everything ready to go back in. As soon as winter comes, open the door, they're down them tunnels and they're in. This one's all being cleaned out as well. Fresh sawdust a lot. This one's just getting done now. I'm going to finish it tonight. Clean it all. So, but like I say, people take the mickey and say, you clean them out so much, it's spotless where you are. There's Taffy looking for his jelly look. Um, but you know, he'll last, last, last longest to me. So, it's like that. Got a kid in Wales and Oak, old Phil. He looks after his monkeys very, very well. Some people in London, it's not all people with monkeys who don't look after them. So, you know, there's a lot of very good keepers. And, uh, do you want to about bringing this monkey van out? I can't see the why. Because it's going to disrupt everything. People's going to start keeping them in sheds, like I say. Harding them. These poor buggers will never see daylight again. Harding them in garden sheds and that. So, I don't know, I see the baby one. one. I think you're getting from Holland and Barrett. I'm not sure what it says on the packet, look. That's a packet, look. Vitamin D3. The kids. Holland and Barrett. There's 200, 200 international units here, son. There he is, big lad. You've got a black face as well, haven't you? Come on then, get it then. Come on then. Here's, here's uh, Oliver. He's ten months old. There's Dad. No Mum. You know. Come on then. Come on then. Come on, son. This is a little baby look. He's about eighteen weeks old. Come on. One there. One there. Look, there's Dad. Full troops up there. Look. Two, three, four. Uh, they're loving it. Yeah, just want to have a quick catch up with you. So, like I say, he's paid to keep them clean and look after them. Which I've done for the last like 13 years now. So, see how it goes this summer. Right, I'll see you all later. Bye.